they started wanting us to do hard money day one. As we went back and forth on what would make us comfortable, we landed on five business days. They okay. said, that gives us enough time to at least get in there, see if there's anything major that's going to scare us or, you know, that we know we don't have in a budget to fix. And if not, if there's small stuff, we can obviously work around those kind of issues. So that's where we netted out. But in that process, that was like maybe the second thing that uh, slowed down our process. And then I was just in town looking at the property right before we signed the agreement. And lo and behold, there's a pretty substantial leak happening mm-hmm. in, uh, in the basement. So I sent the video to the broker and then we talked back and forth about, well, how is this going to get fixed? And keep in mind, we're not under contract. We've agreed to the LOI. We have our attorneys hammering out the PSA right now, the purchase sell agreement, but we're not technically under contract. And again, with my money going hard after five business days, I wanted to make sure this was going to be remedied correctly. So this is something else that kind of dragged on the the signing of the purchase sell agreement and i think the brokers just kind of getting irritated that there's different things that keep dragging us on but again you know i'm trying to make sure we protect ourselves and they don't do a crappy patch job to get that fixed and okay it's no longer leaking but now i've got to deal with this issue and who knows what else this is you know this may be an underlying issue that there are other problems at the property so for us it's given us some pause and i've talked to my partners about it so it's just one of those things where we have some concern. We still want to move forward. We just need to make sure we protect ourselves in that process of moving forward. 